Got the chick I call it Lola She feel like the ocean Like to drink and smoke some Doja And I feel like smoking Plus she good at charming Hey, what is going on you guys? It's your boy Frick here Coming back with another Clash Royale video And today we are following up the video previously in the week where I did all rare cards Today we are doing all common cards As you can see here, I have got the Ice Spirit, Zap, Minions, Royal Giant, Goblins, Fire Spirits, Archers and Elite Barbarians I would have used a Mortar deck but Mortar is not that good unless you have a spell like Fireball and Rocket And since they're rare cards, I can actually use them in today's deck So we went ahead and used a Royal Giant deck We have that Zap for that nice little chip spell damage we also have the archers to target air along with that minion with those three electric minions sorry and then we have the ice spirit that are also targets air our damage per second goes to goes to elite barbarians and then our main win condition is the royal giant of course which is up there level 12 boy so without further ado guys before we get into this video i want you to hit the like button down below 200 likes can we get 200 likes for a double upload today we have been killing it with the like game this past week i want 200 likes and i'll give you that funny moments montage that i know you want i know you guys love them so 200 likes for that funny moments montage it will come out in the same day as today if you get the 200 likes today that is so yeah guys Appreciate all the likes that you've already hit down and make sure to comment down below and subscribe if you're new Let's get into the first game So our first game is versus someone called Kyril or Kyril I'm not actually sure how to say his name, but we have Royal Giant in our starting hand So I'm gonna go ahead and put the Royal Giant at the back right right now There it goes the Royal Giant is placed. We are waiting to see what he has to offer us He is only level 12, so we should be able to come out with a win here. He has got a Sparky Wow, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do this. Wait till you see this, guys. I am gonna fake push the right lane and then drop a whole pile of troops on that left lane right there, and we're gonna see what we can actually do. That Sparky's gonna shoot. Then I'm gonna drop an Ice Spirit. Uh, my, did I just get the freaking, I just got the uh, the glitch. What's that glitch called, man? Where, uh, where you can't drop cards and stuff. That was that was quite insane. I couldn't drop cards there for a sec. It's happened to me again. What? I can't. Look, I'm- What? <laughs> what? Hello? Hello? I literally can't drop the Ice Spirit. Look, it says no card selected. And I'm literally clicking on the screen. What? Hello? Supercell? Wait, try and- Oh, there we go. Now, the... now it actually works. Okay. Okay, Supercell. I see you. I see you, Supercell. Because this actually happened, I'm going to go ahead and play four games in today's video. So you may thank Supercell for more, for more Ferg. Look, when I tap, I can't actually put the thing down. I need to zap to actually bring it out and actually get somewhere with the card. That's kind of insane. So yeah, guys, thanks Supercell for uh, getting four, four games today in today's video instead of only three. I usually do about three. I actually have three spectators right now. What a coincidence. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and see if we can make the comeback here. Let me see what I can do. What? Look at that. I'm literally, I've got Elite Barbarians. Like, what is going on? Supercell. Hello? I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna title this. I broke the game. Cause that is insane. Go, 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 go. No! We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna keep pushing that. We're gonna keep pushing. I guess there's nothing real we can lose at this point. Just because of the fact that our game's already broken. And we have to like drag out instead of just drop. Which is kind of insane. Oh, so he goes ahead and drops his tasty little arrows there, getting some really good arrow value for himself. We're going to go ahead and drop the Elite Barbarians with the Fire Spirit, with Goblins, waiting for the Zap value to come in. It does not come in, unfortunately. He drops that Giant there on the defense. That is really unfortunate for us. We're going to go ahead and Zap all of those minions and get a couple hits off of our on his tar. It doesn't look like there's enough time to actually get the comeback here, but it doesn't matter because our game actually glitched really, really badly this game. He's gonna log all of that, I'm pretty sure. Nope, he's not gonna log all of that. He went ahead and zapped it. So I think that's all she wrote, guys. We could not do anything that game. That was insane. I couldn't believe I couldn't actually drop cards there. You guys seen that I was clicking and it said no card selected when I had clearly selected the Elite Barbarians and the Goblins and all of my cards in my deck. This guy is gonna go ahead and beat Amos, which is kind of crazy. I really hope somehow this guy sees the video and understands why I did not absolutely kick his ass, because I know I would have kicked his ass if I had have got the chance to. So without further ado guys, let's get into game number two. 
So game number two is against another level 11. Hopefully our game does not glitch and we actually are able to play a full game right here. We have got Elite Barbs in our hand right now. If he does not have a counter for these, he is absolutely screwed. Oh, he has the Executioner. We put it on the same side, unfortunately. I still think that's... Oh, he has Elite Barbarians as well. Right, let's see what we can do here. He's going to drop those Elite Barbarians down. I don't think I'm going to counter this one Elite Barbarian. I'm just going to wait for the Executioner to come down. It's still going to get a hit. Unfortunately, it does about 200 damage or something like that. I want to see if we can... Oh, no. This is not good. I'm going to go ahead and drop the Ice Spirit right there. The Executioner goes ahead and dies. And then... Oh, we got one Archer alive. So I'm going to put a Royal Giant in front of this one Archer. Hopefully, he drops something like one Elixir Skeletons and we can just clear them up. That would be pretty dope right here. So the Royal Giant is ahead on his tar. Damn, I meant to drop Zap, but I accidentally dropped the minions. Unfortunately, the uh, the Baby Dragon is actually going to kill our minions right here. He only has a level 4 Baby Dragon? What? Level 4 Baby Dragon? This is what happens at the start of the season, guys. When I'm sitting here doing challenges for you guys to enjoy, I'm playing against literally people who have, like... Like, levels that are unbelievably low. That is insane. I haven't seen a level 4 epic and i don't know how long man that's so crazy so he's gonna go ahead and drop the e-barbs right there oh yo we're actually getting so much damage off right now look how much damage we got off right there that's awesome so we're gonna go ahead and drop our archers on the defense right now waiting for his elite barbarian and his oh no i did it again i dropped the goblin straight into the elite barbarian that was kind of unfortunate guys our um executioner is gonna go ahead and kill those archers our minions are obviously going to die to the Executioner. I wanted to get the health off the Executioner, though. So that is why I sacrificed the three Elixir to kill the Executioner. Because it would have got a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of shots off right there. Three a lot. That's how a lot he would have got off. That's how much damage he would have got off, I mean. And we're going to put a Royal Giant at the bridge. Hashtag noob tactics. Let's go. Let's see what he has. Goblin Gang. I'm predicting he's going to drop that Goblin Gang right here. So I dropped the Archers on that defense. We're going to go ahead and drop Elite Barbarians. Oh, he drops the Elite Barbarians also. So I'm going to go ahead and zap, and then I'm also going to Ice Spirit this. Hopefully it gets off. Yes, it does. Indeed it does, guys. That is awesome for us. Our uh, Elite Barbarians are going to kill that tar? Yeah, they are. So we got an amazing push-off right there. I'm going to go ahead and drop a Royal Giant around near the back right now, so that we can get a nice big push, solid push-off right here. Uh, I'm also going to drop Elite Barbarians around that Executioner. Hopefully it gets them. Nice, it got them before the other stuff did. So we're going to go ahead and kill that Giant fairly easily. Then I'm going to follow up the Elite... Or the Elite Barbarian? The Royal Giant with our minions. We're going to go ahead and kill one Elite Barbarian right there. We're going to kill one minion. We're going to kill another minion. We're going to kill the last minion. And then our stuff... Oh no, we didn't kill the last minion. I am wrong, but we still easily won this game. Hashtag Ferg Fam, let's go! Let's go on to game number three. Game number three. Usually this would be my final game, but as I promised, I'm going to be playing four games today because that thing happened at the start where the card glitch happened so we're gonna go ahead and drop elite barbarians at the bridge right now if he has air we've got those fire spirits to counter it i'm gonna go ahead and zap that Ooh, yo yo this is gonna get so much damage bro let's go look how much damage we've done to that tar it is already down to 1600 and it's literally the first 30 seconds of the game it looks really good for us right now guys we went ahead and zapped those minions so that they got minimal damage off in our tar. They're only going to get about 5 hits off. Usually they would have got like 10 or 11 hits off. So that was a really good trade for us. 1 for 3. A few damage hits on our tar. So, uh... I don't actually know what I'm going to do now. I don't, I don't know. I think Royal Giant... Oh, I meant to place it at the buy, but I placed it a little bit too far forward for that. So we'll see what we can do here. I think I'm going to drop the archers behind the Royal Giant in case he has air because he hasn't shown any air yet and most decks have some air card in them like come on guys wait I actually have a plan here we're gonna split push right now let's go let's go attract the princess we're gonna drop those minions with the Royal Giant we're gonna see what this guy does oh did it target the Royal Giant it did target the no it didn't but we zapped it anyway we're gonna get some really really nice value off right here we dropped that ice spirit down and we dropped the fire spirits up with the royal giant probably a little waste of a fire spirits right there but it doesn't matter we are still so far in the lead right now i don't even care bro i don't even care we're so far in the lead right now against this newbie level 11 level 11s bro i'm so close to level 13 i'm so bullying this guy right now he's just looking at my cards and he's just like wow why am i even playing this guy why is he not pushed 
Little does he know, I'm out here making content, I'm out here grinding for you guys. I'm out here making videos for you guys to watch, hashtag FergFam in the chat, let's go. We're gonna drop, what are we actually gonna drop here? Can our archers kill his princess though? That is, no they can't, no, there's no way, there's no way that did that, what? So we're gonna go ahead and drop the royal giant on the back left right here. And we're gonna go and defend this Valkyrie with our elite barbarians and then drop goblins for the... Yes, the miner actually targeted the goblins. Let's go, let's go. So we're going to kill this uh, hog rider really, really quick for us. And then we are going to drop the fire spirits behind the royal giant. Hoping that he drops something splash triply. Splash triply? Splash, splash trippy? That's the right word. Yeah, splash trippy. That is definitely the right word. So we're going to go ahead and counter these minions right here. And we're probably going to end up taking this guy's... Oh, nope, never mind. Spoke too soon. Ferg's always speaking too soon. But it doesn't matter anyway, because I'm going to drop another Royal Giant down. That's how much we are bullying this guy right now. I don't even care about that right side tower. You can take that, man. I don't care. I want this 2 crown though. Let's get this 2 crown. We got the 2 crown on lockdown. Easy game. GG level 11. Sorry for bullying you, fa bullying you fam. But we got to be out here creating content for the Ferg fam. Let's go. So without further ado, guys, Let's get into the fourth and final replay of today, boy. I keep saying replay instead of saying, like, instead of saying game. I always say replay. I'm just so used to it now. I'm actually playing live. It's so weird. That happened to me a couple days ago and, and a few videos ago as well. So we're going to go ahead and drop the elite barbs down right here. And we're going to see what we can... No way did this guy just let that happen. What? Yo, we got so much damage off his tower right there. Unfortunately, this guy did not have a counter or he was too late into the game. This guy is level 12, so it is going to be an even matchup today, guys. Or in this replay, guys. LOL. So I wonder what we're going to actually do here. Our archers are too far forward for... Yeah, I'm just going to drop the Royal Giant anyway. Screw it. We have got the upper hand right here. So we're going to go ahead and... Whoa! Okay, that was not good. I'm going to drop the goblins here on the defense. And then I'm going to zap all of those bats. Because I know that the bats will... What? That Night Witch has literally got 1 HP! No way! That's insane, right? I'm going to drop the Fire Spirits here to defend against the Night Witch. And the... Yes, let's go! That was clutch at Fire Spirit right there. Two of them died. One of them lived. The last one that lived killed both of those archers right there. Let's go! We're going to see what we can do right here. We have only got 568 HP left to get off his tower. And this is going to be a W for us. So hopefully we can do that. And hopefully we can defend against his push. We're going to drop Archers right here. Because he has just dropped Mega Minion. I'm going to see if we can get some defensive value off right here. I'm going to drop that Ice Spirit. Will it be good placement? Yes, that is perfect placement of that Ice Spirit right there. And we're going to go ahead and drop a Royal Giant at the bridge and hope to get that tar down right now. He has Fireball, I believe, so he might Fireball. Yes, he is. Now we're going to drop those minions. We preemptively didn't drop the minions right there because we knew that he had Fireball. That's something you want to keep track of. You want to keep track of where their spells are in their rotation and what spells they actually have, as I just did right there. Uh, so you know what, guys? Screw it. We're going to go for that 3 crime though. I don't want that 2 crime. We need to finish this game on a 3 crime though. Let's go. E-Barb's on that tar, killing it right now. That tar is down below 3,000 HP. You know what I might do? I might give him the 3 crime, or I might give him the crown, or I might not. I said, you know what? Screw this guy. I don't want to give him the sympathy. Or I want I don't want to give him the thimp sympathy sympathy? Sympathy, that is the word. I was like, what am I saying right now? But then I realized that is actually the word that I was trying to say. That was kind of dumb of me. I am a noob. Right, we're gonna go ahead and drop the e-barbs on the defense right now, and then we're gonna zap all of this stuff. Whoa, that zap was so so perfect right there. Now the Mega Minion is going to go down to our tower and then we're going to spawn the minions in front. Whoa, I did not see that mini P.E.K.K.A the whole game. That was the first time he has dropped the mini P.E.K.K.A. I did click goblins to drop them right there, but it dropped the archers as you will see if you replay that. I have no idea what just happened there with the with the drop thing. I'm going to go ahead and zap those archers out of the game. Wait, what? Oh yeah, the zap was nerfed like three months ago. I'm such a noob. <laughs> I'm such a friggin' noob. So there's another bullied match right there. Easy wins for the Ferg fam, guys. Let's go. Can we hit 200 likes on today's video? That would be insane. And also, if you haven't already, subscribe up and comment what you want to see in the down below. Remember, 200 likes gets a double upload every single day of July. So hit that like button down below. Make sure to smash it. Make sure to tell your friends about my channel. We are the fastest growing and percentage-wise Clash Royale channel right now. We are growing so much, so fast. 
in terms of how small we are. It's absolutely insane. Got to give a big shout out to Eclipse for shouting me out a couple days ago. That was absolutely insane as well. I think that was actually a couple of weeks ago now. But whatever. Make sure to hit that like button down below. 200 likes. Double upload. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And without further ado, guys, let's roll the outro. Oh.